welcome to Health and Social Care. On level two, we have a one year course, it's eight units and this is through OCR. Some of the units that we do are communication, individual rights, individual needs, ensuring safe environments, anatomy, physiology, health and social care services, impact of diet, and looking at the human lifespan development. Then there's level three, which is either two A levels or three A levels, and that's a two year course across years 12 and year 13, and that's BTEC. Some of the units that we do here are human lifespan development, working in health and social care, meeting individual care needs, sociological perspectives, inquiries into current research, there's a work experience unit with 100 hours work experience, principles of safe practice and promoting public health. Then there are some additional units for the extended diploma which includes anatomy and physiology, psychological perspectives, supporting individuals with additional needs, physiological disorders and assessing children's development support needs. Some of the topics that we look at are contemporary, uh, thinking about changes within society and global issues as well. Also we have things that are topical like obesity, work-life balance, mental health, uh, self-esteem, then there's some age-related conditions like dementia or stroke, diabetes type 2, then there's global pandemics like we have at the moment or antimicrobial resistance drugs where dr drugs are getting cleverer and typical antibiotics do not kill diseases so they have to find new ones. And some of the topical things that hit the press, NHS being a big employer in the world and the work that NHS does, uh, that's relating to obesity, cases of diabetes on the rise, and then some typical careers that you might want to consider if you take this subject would be things like nursing, anything medical, uh, care work, social worker, occupational health, youth worker, paramedic, radiographer, midwifery. Thank you.